Hi Trader, welcome back. On Binance, to set your hedge mode, you have to click on the features and then click on USDT features. By default, your one-way mode would look like something like this. But the easiest way to know that you're not on a hedge mode is when you don't have a buy button for the short position. Here we only have buy long and then sell short or close long. To switch or set the hedge mode, you have to click on the setting here, then click on position mode, then click on hedge mode. Close this and close the position. As easy as that. Now you see I have a button to open long and open short. So that is how to set the hedge mode on your desktop. Next, I'll be showing you how to set the, desk, the hedge mode on your mobile phone. This is how the one-way mode looks on the mobile phone. To turn on the hedge mode on your mobile phone, click on the triple dots here and then click on preference. Go to position mode, click on hedge mode. As easy as that, we have switched from one-way mode to hedge mode. Now you can see I could open long here and open short here simultaneously at the same time. Before I continue to showing you how to open the hedge position, first of all, what is hedging? Hedging on Binance features or other crypto exchanges or crypto future exchanges allows traders to simultaneously hold both long position and short position on the same trading pair in the same account and, and at the same time. Just like what you're seeing here, I'm holding BTC Perpetua for the same trading pair at the same time for the same trading account making almost the same profit and loss though my profit is greater here whatever i'm teaching you here today is applicable to both binance kucoin bybit coinbase and even on forex they are the same principles the only difference might be just the trading fee to hedge a trade or open a hedge trade on your mobile phone all you have to do is get the coin here we'll be using pepper and then enter any amount let me just be more specific here i'll be buying ten thousand pieces of this on long the market price and ten thousand pieces of this on short and then you could see we now have these two trades open simultaneously on a careful examination here, you would notice that my reputation is at 0 0.9971, which is very, very further away from the entry point of 0 0.0087. In fact, to blow your mind, paper has never reached 0 0.1 cents ever. Talk more of 0 0.9. To open a position on your desktop, all you have to do is enter the amount you want to open here. Let's say we are going for sheep, 10,000 pieces of this coin. And then click on open it depends on you you could choose limit order or market order for this tutorial i'll be going for the market order usually i don't encourage anyone to open a position with the market order and then click on open same thing ten thousand pieces of these open shot down here you could see we already have our ship open simultaneously what are the benefits of this our liquidation here is 2.3475. Shib Inu in all its lifetime has never gone all the way to even 0.1 cent compared to $2. This might take even 50 years to get to this point. So that is one of the advantages of hedging. Usually most people think that the only advantage of hedging is to mitigate risk or uh, maybe when you are losing. Nah. There are so many advantages of hedging. The very first thing that drove me into studying this strategy is to cancel out or recover a losing trade. Every trader has a losing moment, but how you handle it makes you more professional than others. Later in this lecture, I'll be showing you how to cancel out or recover a losing trade through hedging. And then it helps us to reduce our liquidation level, especially if you are going for a long term investment that you feel like maybe yeah this is the starting point for the crypto or any asset but at the current moment if anything goes wrong or there's a high volatility you might get liquidated so we use hedging to reduce our liquidation level then they help us to confirm the direction of trend yes hedging can help you confirm whether this tr trend is okay to short or to long i will show you all this in our different hedging strategies then they also help us to lock profit or loss 
you might decide you don't want to close a trade and you just lock your profit or just lock your loss so they also help us to invest in crypto futures i have a strategy here very mind-blowing strategy here which i call the hedge crypto futures investment strategy here i'll be teaching you how to hold a position on hedge mode from one bull market to the other bear market and how to profit from it then they help us to trade ranging market this is one of the best time to use hedge mode because in the hedging ranging market most traders lose money lose a lot of money more than even the bull or bear market then they can't even decide where the market is and the volatility would always be high and also they help us to trade volatile cryptos or altcoins when you hedge you are more likely not to get into trouble of losing your capital especially in a top gainer crypto they also help us to get what we call near zero loss meaning if you can hedge properly the chances of you losing or having losing trades are lesser also they give us peace of mind this is the most beautiful thing think about it let's say i made a mistake and took a position but this position is neither on a loss or on a profit but my prediction was that this should be on profit but the market turned out to be on loss but because i'm hedging i'm neither on a loss or on a profit so it gives us peace of mind knowing that we can always take the same amount of capital just depending on the trading fee and with hedging you don't need complex ta you don't need to ah this is the best entry this is the sniper entry with hedging mode we don't need complex technical analysis just do it and the most important thing capital insurance if you hedge a position now just like what i'm doing now i'm hedging btc here at any moment i can close these trades and incur the lowest loss or zero loss accept the trading fee and then i can decide to withdraw my capital and go and do anything with it so with hedging if you're not sure of the market you can just hedge even if the market crashes now whatever happens to the crypto because you are hedging and uh, you are hedging in such a way that remember these are different strategies you are hedging in such a way that you can withdraw your capital there is a hedging that you can withdraw your capital though i will teach you guys all this in our subsequent lesson let me give you a real life example of how to use hedge mode before we get in into the different application of hedging let's say we longed 1000 bnb at 250 dollars and the price moved to 240 dollars this is incurring a total loss of two thousand dollars for us to cancel out this two thousand dollars loss by hedging we need to buy a short trade with a total size of coin higher in amount more than the previous open position for example the previous position here which is long had a, a total amount of coin of 1000 bmb at 250 the new position should have at least twice the size of the previous position in our new position we need to open a short of 2000 bmb at the 240 price or the any current market price this is what our new position would look like this is what happens our new position here because we open the position at the 240 dollars when it moves to 220 our profit will be eight thousand dollars because we didn't close our old position too our old position would also move to that the same 220 but we incur a total loss of six thousand this will now give us a total gain of two thousand by this we already cancelled out our loss here i'm going to teach you guys how to use all these strategies later on all you have to do now is just to join our trading community thank you trader see you in the next lesson